Hello everybody and welcome back this is uh, video 8 and uh, we are dealing with uh, our design center in the previous video we had problem with our teeth here the mesh was not that good and now it's everything is fine the only thing that I did that I go here right click and edit and he forced me to use the right 61 millimeter and as we see everything is fine with our calculation there is no errors but I'll show you something after that now our calculation all these calculations we can have them in our project by using this one results this is our results and all of these the da data will be mentioned here who's the designer or the author okay this is our uh, gear ratio module a little pressure angle 61 the center distance and this is our uh, gears calculation number of teeth pitch diameter etc etc face width and here we have our all the parameters that we need we have some uh, images here that shows us loads 3 kilowatt 5000 torque and all other calculations the material ultimate uh, tensile strength yield strength at the end we have our factors elasticity and zone factor and you have positive check calculation it's positive everything is fine so you can save all this file file save as and go to your folder and save it save you can save it HTML or you can save it as a, docu as a word document anything you wish save so anytime you can go back to it or you can add it to your uh, project okay so we finished with our gears now we put some keys before that I have to arrange my shaft and my body so I'll make a constraint angle constraint I'll open my shaft 1 this is the origin of my shaft 1 and make it with the body origin of the body with this one and the desired angle is 0 so I set my shaft 0 angle with the body and I'll name this one is drive because I'll drive it after that and hit OK now again I will make an angle constraint shaft 1 shaft 2 because when I I'll put my key I want I I want it to be 90 degrees what is uh, shaft 2 okay shaft 2 origin okay what is it? This one, XC max zero. I can't see it. Why? I can't see it. Oh my god. It can't be displayed. Why? Oh, shaft two. Okay. This is shaft two. Sorry. Yes. 
so this one and I I need them to be 90 degrees with each other okay click OK this is I shaft 2 and this one edit again to be suppressed after that uh, to be suppressed just for reference okay in order to know it now we'll go to our keys design key if we go here and see our keys this key is uh, ISO 2491A6420 6x4 band 20 okay let's go back ISO 246x6 no just take the reference this is my and this is my okay first orientation okay let us see she do something here we'll take it before orientation okay reference to I can have okay just take it down it won't be able to take why something happened man okay much close okay something stuck I'll do it again key let's check our ISO 2048 where is our keys 242491 2491, where is 2491 here? We have 2491, ISO. 2491, yes. Okay. Let's take our reference here. Face. Okay, reference here and the hub. Okay, yeah, so let's do some changes. Reference of the hub. Okay. The orientation. Where is my uh, shaft one? Shaft one. Shaft one. Shaft one. This is shaft one. I take this one. No, I'll take this one. Yes, this is the orientation that I need. And now we'll click here and take it as 20. This is 20. And double click and make it down 10 millimeters down as we can see here we have 10 millimeters down okay and the length of it is 20 6 by 4 by 20 let's go back here 6 by 4 20 okay this is 20 and I'll check the other the other thing what we have here orientation okay this one, yes. Radiance. We'll take anything. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Everything is fine, yes. Click OK. Okay. 
record our first key something wrong happened with it it didn't take that let's take it here with the flush this is a flush 10 it goes down save yes to all okay so this is our first key let's take the other one the same way okay and take this there our reference is here if, uh, okay <coughs> it takes 5 by 3 by 14 let us see what's the other key for this one is sorry 5 3 20 okay go back okay this is my hub I'll take it down okay refer uh, orientation sorry of shaft 2 the orientation I'll take yes this one I think so yeah I need it no I need it the orientation 90 degrees on that one orientation yes okay so now reference will take as a reference and we'll make it 20 let's go back again the length is 20 no 20 yes and we'll take it down 10 millimeters okay the same as that one and if it's okay okay voila we have our key here of course if we wanna move this one they want to be moved because we did an angle constraint there let's go back to be suppressed and we'll suppress this one suppress save okay and let's drive our assembly drive 360 go and here is our assembly with our keys and everything is fine are going meshing stop return back cancel what I wanna show you and I wanna show our guys in inventor there's something wrong with their uh, equations when you put this together and we give it a look close look here look we have when the teeth are mashing together they are not mashing that correct even our calculation gives us everything is fine that's why I did uh, calculation in 60 and take it apart a little bit so uh, our guys in inventor please check your equations there something wrong with the appearance but in the real life it will be everything is fine so we'll come uh, to end to this video now and we'll continue on next video with other part